So we're gonna we're gonna dive right into the lectures. Our first lecture is an overview of the flood hazard framework, um, and our learning objectives um, are going to describe the overall framework for using RMC Best Fit and RMC RFA software to support USACE dam and levee safety flood hazard analysis. So we're going to describe how the software supports flood hazard analysis and explain the difference between stage frequency and volume frequency curves. Okay, so a little bit of math right in the morning is what everybody loves, I know. So here is an equation. Don't be scared. It's not that bad. Um, this is the general risk equation that USACE uses. Risk is defined as the probability of the hazard times the probability of failure given the hazard times the consequences given the failure. So you'll notice that vertical line is the conditional probability symbol. That means it's given the thing that happened before it in the equation. So I'll say that one more time. So it's the probability of hazard times the probability of failure given that the hazard exists times the consequences given the failure occurs. So those are conditional probabilities, those second and third terms. So how do flood hazards fit into the risk framework? Because that's what we're here for, right? We're, we're all H&H &H engineers of some, some variety here in this room. Um, so you know, how does this play into this equation? Flood hazards plays a major role because flood hazard is the first term in the risk equation. The probability of the flood hazard is estimated using RMC Best Fit and RMC RFA software tools. That's what you're here to learn about this week. The tra this training course focuses on the flood hazard component of the risk equation. So that's that first term there. Okay, a key component or the key components of flood hazard analysis include flood hazard curves. Oops, okay, sorry. Uh, flood hazard curves and the probable maximum flood, or the PMF. This training class focuses on the development of the flood hazard curves. And there are two general types of flood hazard curves that are needed for risk assessment, the volume frequency curve and the stage frequency curve. The best fit, or RMC best fit software, is used to develop the volume frequency curves, and RMC RFA is the software that's used to develop the stage frequency curves. And we'll touch on that as we go through the course. But you'll notice that the agenda is broken up into two sections. The first section is all about RMC best fit. And the second section is all about RMC RFA. And that's because that's the order that we'll use those software. Um, so we will learn how to develop volume frequency curves like this one using RMC best fit. And we'll start, our lectures will start with how to input data into this software. And we'll go all the way through and finish up with explaining how to produce report quality plots. And we will also walk you through the process of developing stage frequency curves, like the one that's shown here using RMC RFA software. And these are the types of curves of hazard, flood hazard curves that you would use in a risk assessment. So speaking of risk, here we can see an example of a risk estimate. The annual probability of failure is shown on the vertical axis and the average life loss due to failure is shown on the horizontal axis. Each of the boxes represents a potential failure mode and the red lines represent the tolerable risk guidelines. Some of you may be very familiar with this type of plot, um, often called a little FN plot. The flood hazard is a key component of the risk estimate since the annual probability of failure is equal to the probability of the flood hazard times the probability of failure. For example, the risk estimate for overtopping of an embankment is mostly a function of the probability that the flood overtops the embankment. Flood hazard curves directly affect the risk estimate and are an essential element of every risk assessment. So don't let those other guys forget that the water is the most important part is what I'm telling you. Okay, so here is um, some, some resources that you can use um, 
some most these are all RMC publications, um, and these are also software resources that can help guide you in the development of flood hazard analysis. So you've got um, our stage frequency curve manual. That's that. Let's see on which side is it for you? The left side, over there, um, the RMC TR 2018-03, and then um, me on the font is very small, but um, we've got a couple of documents here. This one is about regulation, upstream regulation. So that's a, a really handy manual. Gives you some practical um, ways to handle um, the development of an unregulated inflow data set. And then um, up here is the best fit quick start guide. So for both pieces of software, there's a help at the very top, and that will lead you to the user's manual um, if you, if you get stuck on something and you want to know a little bit more about how that part works, um, and it gets into the technical part and also how to use the software.